Hello and welcome back to another episode. In this episode I'm going to be doing a painting in the style and inspired by the artist Mark Ray Martin. Now as you can see I've already drawn out my object, the object that being is sunglasses. Now the paint I'll be using is poster paint onto buff paper. The colours that I've chosen are colours such as blue, yellow ochre, lemon yellow and white. Now, as I said earlier, it's in the style of Martin Craig Martin. So I've already looked at his work to get inspiration. So I know the style and what I'm looking for. Now, you can choose any object you wish to draw. Mine happens to be sunglasses because that's my everyday object during the summer time. Now, before you get started, make sure you've got the correct paints. Make sure you've got a paintbrush and some water. Also, you're somewhere where you're comfortable to create your artwork when you're ready we shall begin now the first color I'm using is blue and I'm applying blue as the main color of my glasses now the reason I'm doing that is because I've looked at Mark Craig Martin's work and his work is very bright and bold it stands out he doesn't stick to the eventual tones of the everyday object so yes my sunglasses are black but I'm using blue as my color now as you can see, I'm applying blue down first. Now I'll cover that as my first layer. Now it doesn't come out nice or as smooth. That's why I apply white over the top. Now I want the glasses to look like a cool, smooth effect. So I apply my blue first, and once I'm confident and covered at each area, I then apply my white. And as you can see here, it shows a lighter blue tone. I then make sure I capture each corner, and then do some highlights in different areas where I think light might show. Okay, and then I refine the edges. So I'm just using a little bit of white, a little bit of blue, just to refine and neaten those edges. Now for the framework, I'm going to use yellow and yellow ochre, but I want this painting to stand out, look a bit more eye catching, vibrant. Now, once my painting is dry, I'm going to refine my edges and draw in the rest of the detail of my sunglasses. Make sure you take your time, rub out any mistakes. Now once you've finished with your pencil and you're happy with refinement, you can then get a darker pencil and go over your lines. Now by doing this, it makes your image stand out a little bit more effective. Already you can see that my sunglasses are becoming more eye-catching just by applying the dark tone around the edges. You can glide in certain areas to give reflection. You can do this with a dark tone and light tone. But refining with pencil works very well to give you an overall effective and eye-catching result.